Pedro Neves at pedroneves.org. Coming to you live today to talk to you about one of the top uh, skills that most network marketers uh, have difficulties, and that is the closing. When we show our business opportunity, uh, as soon as that video or uh, you finish your presentation, you ask them a few questions and then you're trying to, to sell that presentation again. So that is a big common mistake and I'll tell you the reason why. Because you try, you come across as a salesperson as you're trying to sell. So the thing that you want to avoid is, is ask this question, what do you think? Because when you ask this question, what do you think, it triggers uh, a, a component in your brain that triggers logic, okay? People don't make decisions on logic, they make decisions on emotions. So if you know that, what would be the question that you would ask? What did you like best or what did you like most? Isn't this exciting? Cool stuff, right? So you, you want to sound excited. You want to project your excitement to your prospect. So again, do not ask, what do you think? You want to completely erase that question out of your vocabulary. Number two, you want to project your enthusiasm into your prospects. When they ask you questions, it is a good idea to, to make a third party call because uh, by doing that, you letting your prospect know that hey, they really don't have to know anything to do this business. You simply have to make a phone call. Third party validation also, or a third party call also lets your, your prospect know that there are other people doing the business and they're successful. In addition to that, it also lets them know that this is a duplicatable system. So just like Burger King or Dunkin' Donuts or a restaurant chain, the model it works because it's duplicatable, right? Uh, so that's very important in order to project that those thoughts to, to, your, to your prospect. So guys, at the end of the day, this is what you really want to do. You don't want to come across as a salesperson because 95% of people in, in the world hate salespeople or hate to sell stuff. So that's the last thing you want to, to project is selling. Also, if they are negative, don't try to sell it, sell the business. You're wasting your time. Move on. Again, people make decisions on emotions, not on rational decisions. Just be cool about it. Don't stress. If they feel that you're being defensive, if they feel that you're frustrated, if they feel that you're not confident, it is most likely they don't join your business. That's what I found out. This is why I'm sharing this with you. I'm excited to share this with you. I hope you got some value. If you do, feel free to share. Uh, you can reach me at pagerneves.org or you can find me on Facebook, the Road to Success Coaching blog. I'll talk to you soon. You make it a great day.